Pippa was first born in Hong Kong, um, and her birth mother there actually placed her for adoption. Unfortunately, the Pippa's first adoptive mother did have some mental health issues and some violence escalated in the home. She did uh, eventually try and hurt Pippa quite badly. She did try and drown her. She was 22 months when she experienced that violence. Jess and I had adopted previously. We wanted to adopt a child that nobody else had looked at. We knew it was important for us to, to find a child where it had been hard to place for them. When we met with their foster parents, it was Nikki, it was Nikki that kind of facilitated the meeting and she was so amazing at asking the right kinds of questions to them so that we could find out about the real Pippa and find out everything that isn't on paper. And You say, you know, it was love at first sight and with Pippa it was just exactly that. We were in the house for probably two minutes and she had already climbed into Jessica's lap and was hugging her. She was very much like a, a like a new toddler. Like so, she she could walk, but her gait was very unsteady. She couldn't eat food, and she had um, a liquid diet. She didn't really talk very much. Pippa was very afraid of water, and bathing in shower time has been. It was a challenge at the beginning. And it was a fear that you could see. Like, she would tense up. It was, it was horrible, especially knowing where that, all that fear had come from. So we didn't even start in the water. We started beside the water. We tried to take all the focus off of cleaning and the job and just make that fun. For all that it was, it probably only took a couple of months. Like, she came home in June, and I think by August, she, we were at a cottage. She jumped off the dock for the first time, and we <laughs> were just amazed. She has done horseback riding lessons, and she's definitely more social <laughs> with other kids. Now she has very specific, you know, movie loves and, and coloring and just kind of advanced so much from where we saw her when she first came home. She'll feed our dogs and help put dishes away and, you know, help put laundry away and all of that. She's, she likes to, to be needed. She is warm and sunshine, like she just beams, like she radiates happiness and love. Thank you.